She leans left, so emotionally she with, is withdrawn. Tracy DeGabriel has spent 20 years analyzing handwriting. She has low crossing T-bars, which shows that her self-esteem is pretty squashed. So we had her take a look at court papers handwritten by Elizabeth Johnson. The wide spacing shows that she doesn't trust many people. The separation of the P's, you see how it separates the stem from the loop? That is basically showing that she likes to argue. Something Logan McQuarrie, Johnson's one-time boyfriend and Gabriel's father, says he's seen. If she does go into one of her rages, she won't calm down unless she's ready to calm down. And anything that's around her, anything and everything, she just gets mad at, hits her, throws whatever. So really, I, I don't know. Tracy then analyzed McQuarrie's writing in his custodial court documents. I can see that they may have had a challenging relationship. He prints very wide spacing between letters showing that he doesn't have a lot of trust in anybody either. He um, has a wide left margin which shows that he's trying to escape something from his past. So I would say that he's done some things, has some regrets, um, some guilt over some issues. McQuarrie has publicly stated he's working to move past a criminal record and get on with his life. We also had Tracy analyze Tammy Smith's penmanship from court papers. Smith is a person of interest in the case. We have a lot more communication. We have a, a wider ease. Smith has become the most public face of the case, frequently appearing on national TV shows. Whoever wrote this part wants to be heard wants to be understood. And the lack of slant to the letters? Generally overall is vertical, which means that they know when to show emotion, when not to. Christine Harrington, 3TV.